Hello everyone, my name is Chika Ito, and I'm here to share with you my light bow gun status support build. The light bow gun that I'm referring to is the Watchdog's Hall. It can be found in the canine tree. The reason why I picked this gun is its ability to rapid fire poison ammo, paralyzed ammo, and sleep ammo, as well as support your teammates with rapid fire recovery. It also allows you to fire sticky ammo level 2 to KO the monster and slicing ammo to help cut off the tail of the monster. I chose these following skills to optimize the status buildup with Paralyzed Attack Level 3, Sleep Attack Level 2, and Slugger Level 3. The Spare Shot is also an important skill that you should be taking with this build. The Bomber Deer skill is slotted in to help boost the damage of your Barrel Bomb. To achieve the skills that I have, I use the Channeler's Hair Tie and the Channeler's Rope to have Spare Shot Level 3, the Volvedon Vampires, Manahabra Coil, and Manahabra Boots to get Paralyzed Level 3. I stole in Decorations to achieve Slugger Level 3, and I use the Talisman to achieve Sleep Level 2. When it comes to the Switch skill, just use whichever feels best for you. Do note the healing shots do get blocked by the monster, so being able to bolt over the monster and shoot your teammates with your healing shots does help. When it comes to the food buff, I always go for the Dango Specialist because it increases the potency of your abnormal status attacks. That makes it easier to apply status effects such as Paralyze onto the monster. I also go for the Dango Slugger so that it's easy to use your stickies to stun the monster and the Dango Pyro. By just placing down a large barrel bomb, it automatically upgrades it to a mega barrel bomb, increasing your damage to a sleeping monster. When it comes to rotation, I usually start with the poison ammo. The poison ammo is definitely an optimal choice, and I usually use it while waiting for the team to assemble. After using the poison ammo, you will want to put the monster to sleep. The poison ammo will still continue to do its damage without waking the monster up. After that, you and your teammates will put as many bombs as you can. It is advisable to put a sticker onto your radio menu to inform your teammates that you're putting the monster to sleep. After waking the monster up, you'll swap over to your paralyzed shots and paralyze the monster. While your teammates are DPSing the monster, you use the sticky shot to kill the monster. While the monster is KO, you will then cycle through your rotation again. Usually during a 4-man hunt, you only manage to sleep and paralyze the monster twice. Another advantage of using the vault skill is your ability to place mines on the monster. This does not wake the monster up and ensures all your mines hit the monster. Mines that are placed on the monster also does mountain damage. Also, don't forget about your heal shots. Your heal shots heals your teammates. You can heal multiple teammates if they are standing in a row or in a cluster. And that is my status support light bow gun. I do hope you enjoy using this weapon as much as I did. If you like my videos, do subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. Thank you so much and happy hunting!